Hello and welcome to this video tutorial. Um, today I'm going to show you how I access um, macOS EFI partition while on window on Windows. Um, this is probably going to be a tutorial geared towards beginners, um, just in case. And this is very handy to know, just in case. Let's say you lost your USB drive with your EFI partition or you or you can't boot to macOS for some reason and you want to change some settings in your EFI and you can't access it. So this will be very um, like a good tutorial how to do it. Um, uh, usually I use these two programs. It's Minitool, Partition Wizard and Explorer++. Probably there are more ways to to do it but this is the way I do it. Um, I'm gonna link. Uh, I'm gonna leave the links to these two programs in a in a video description below. Um, so one of them is, like I said, Minitool Partition Wizard. The other one is Explorer Plus Plus. With the first program, we mount our EFI partition. And as you can see, for example, if you go to this computer, there are there are no EFI partitions mounted at the, at at this moment. So. I'm going to use that to mount our, our EFI partition and with this program um, we're going to uh, access our EFI uh, so we can do all necessary modifications and changes. So, right, so launch the partition wizard first. Okay, and as you can see um in in this in this ssd i have my um mac os installed and this is the fi partition i want to access because usually the differences are windows create an efi partition with 100 megs and mac os is usually it's usually 200 megs so it's easy to know which one is which one right in order to mount the efi partition we have to change the letter of the partition. So let's do that. Let's do automatic, so let's say letter E. Go apply. And now it will mount that partition for us. So as you can see, the partition is mounted. And now in order to access it, um, if we just double click the EFI partition, you see it will show us that we don't have uh, permissions to access this folder. So in order to um, get a workaround is way around it is um, use this program Explorer++. Make sure you run it as administrator. And here it is. And now if we go to this PC, this is the AFI partition. And this is my EFI folder, you can see open core. And here I can access my uh, config. At the moment I don't have proper tree installed in Windows, but um, this is how you do it. 